Dana fans. For the last few weeks, Harlem has had a series of bad breaks. An attack on CJ Walker Park to name one. Spider-Man intervened to protect the neighborhood, but he didn't do it alone. I'm here with Yankee Lee, the Harlem local who helped Spider-Man save the neighborhood. It felt really good to help people out. Even better when we found out Wilson Fisk was behind it. Shutting him down is a career highlight for me. And Spider-Man. <laughs> I bet. How did you guys stumble on the conspiracy? By talking to people in the neighborhood. They were all looking out for each other, which helped us look out for them. Teo, Caleb, Camila, Haley, Steph, Gloria, if you're listening, thank you. I checked with Wilson Fisk's parole officer, who confirmed the big guy is under tighter security and will likely get some time tacked onto his sentence. Genki and everyone in Harlem, thanks for looking out. Till next time, friends, remember to change your toothbrush every three months. Bye! Side. Cool. You look for the jammer, I'll start pulling records for what the underground's been up to here. Spider-Man, I ran a custom search of this address with some underground-specific queries. This used to be a tombstone hideout. Whoa. What's the history there? The underground and tombstones crew did a few jobs together. Robberies, hits, carjackings. Falling out when a member killed one of tombstone's guys. The underground were outgunned. Until the Tinkerer came along. Yeah. By then, tombstone was in prison, so they were able to sleep in here, no problem.
topic, but do you have like a sound guy to write your intro music? Um, I dated a guy for like half a minute and he was nice enough to write my singer before we hooked up. Oh, if you ever need someone who mixes beats, I uh, I know a guy. That would be amazing, because I am totally tone deaf. Now I just need to find the jammer and shut it down. <sighs> There's the jammer. They kept trophies from their fights with Tombstone. How sentimental. Grave dust. Makes your skin nearly invulnerable. Pete ended up creating a counter drug to stop it. Hope the underground aren't getting into this. One of Tombstone's bikes. Of course he'd have a big muffler. I mean, I think that's a muffler. Those mannequins move? Oh! This place is oh! You're not taking it from us! You never want to see another mannequin. Hey, hideout should be back on the grid. Okay, tipping off the cops. Cool. I'm gonna chase the Tombstone Underground Partnership lead for my series. I should head out before the cops get here and cover everything in crime tape. I 
I should get back to looking for the new form. Time to hit the theater. some rumors making the rounds of the pool halls and sleazy bars. Supposedly, Wilson Fisk has been trying to destabilize Harlem in order to make it cheaper and easier for him to acquire properties. All from behind bars! Now you all know my distaste for conspiracy theories. If there's proof, I will be the first to condemn malfeasance. But until that happens, it is poisonous irresponsible and wrong to repeat such baseless and inflammatory claims. That's the kind of behavior I'd expect from someone like Spider-Man, who several people have told me enjoys a destabilized neighborhood himself because it creates more crime and thus more opportunities for him to make himself look good. So let's be careful what we say and stick to the facts. Okay, people? <laughs> 